The overall goal of this procedure is to present a novel model of in vitro three-dimensional neuronal networks coupled to microelectrode arrays. This is accomplished by first conditioning the central part of the MEA with a mixed solution of poly lysine and laminin, then coat the microbeads with adhesion proteins laminin and poly lysine. The second step is to distribute the suspension of treated microbeads onto a multi-well plate where they will self-assemble and form a uniform layer. The third step of the procedure is to plate the cells onto the active area of the MEA at a density of 2,000 cells per square millimeter to create 2D neuronal networks. Six to eight hours after plating, suspension is transferred from the multi-well plates to the MEA, and the microbeads are allowed to self-assemble in a hexagonal compact structure. Ultimately, confocal microscopy is used to visualize the 3D networks, which are compared to the conventional 2D neuronal networks grown over MEA. The main advantage of this technique over existing methods like in vitro bidimensional cell cultures is that in a bidimensional model, somata and growth cones are flattened and exon dendrites cannot spread in all directions. In addition, burst inactivity dominates the electrophysiological dynamics of bidimensional networks, while in a three-dimensional one, also a random specking activity coexists. We first had the idea of this method when we read the research paper of Sophie Poteau, published in Nature Methods in 2008, in which she used microbits as a scaffold to build three-dimensional neuronal networks. We then adapted this method to MIA to make the first three-dimensional in vitro recall.